Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to bring to movie two of Sora Online progression. I mean, okay, so for me, it's only really been um, a couple of days, but for y'all, it might just be a couple of minutes, maybe even longer. I don't know, because um, I don't know how the freak I'm going to release this, if I'm going to have them both come out at the same time, or like maybe an hour apart. I really don't know yet. I already know I have one, the first movie set out and ready to go, and I was just like, Haha, I need to go ahead and record this one before Friday comes. Um, but of course, you know the gist, of course. We gotta cut it down into parts. So this part will be to the 50, almost 51 minute mark, and then from continuing from 51 all the way into the end, part two but of course i mean with the way movie one ended very similar to um the one episode of season one but different with the fact is yes this new girl has now come in who the heck is she what is she going to be dealing with like is she friend or foe she seems more friendly to me um but you know looks can be deceiving we've all known that <laughs> Um, it does make me wonder, like, what else is gonna go down in this and such? I mean, the only other thing I could, I was thinking about is the ish that I said when I watched the end of movie one, and then I kind of, the couple of days that I've, like, thought about it a little bit more, I was like, well, you know, what if we're going into the situation of Laughing Coffin, which we saw in SAO 2, and then also a little bit of, well, the conclusion and alitization. That could also happen as well, but th there's a lot of things that could happen. Um, maybe like an appearance from you? But, Yuna, wrong person, yeah. So many fucking, I'm thinking of Yui from Delicious Party, pretty cute. Oh my god, wrong series. <laughs> it just reminds me I have to watch pretty cute after this. Wrong series, mm, too many. <laughs> Too many characters with the name Yui, but of course, we're not going to know, but I'm going to stop right here and I will see you guys in a second for the first half. All right. See you then. All right. Part one in three, two, one, go. It's a good thing I'm watching this now because I got a lot of other shit to do today and it's only eight o'clock. This better not make me cry. Nah. Uh, well, there she is. Are you going to die? Because, you know, the last person who introduced themselves in this series, they also died. And, you know, we don't want to play, you know, make that repetitive. 
into a chain. So, you know. <laughs> we out. <laughs>
Yeah, you are right about that. Girl, you gotta eat everything? <laughs> Did she just eat that that quickly? Wait, stop. She did not just eat that that quickly. A sad. And you got invited to neither. Mm -hmm. What thing? Yeah. 
Probably not that long, maybe like a day or two. Girl. <laughs> you wanna stay out all night looking for me? Yeah, well, you know, once again, we're all addicted to something. Mm -hmm. Fucking gotcha. Don't ask me how many pulls I did. And then slowly but sure that we take gambling and everything else, and then you throw your whole life away. You are not going into the fucking catacombs. Is it really that worth it? Okay, never mind. We're going in the catacombs. Mm -hmm. If we die, we die. Something definitely is going to pop out. Come on now.
Please, we don't need that. Great. Okay, a hand. No, oh, okay, never mind. Um, it would get separated. This would happen. Great! <laughs> it's just great! <laughs> that fucking thing. Oh my god! <laughs> Hmm. Now we're real screwed. <laughs> like literally in the bottom of the depths. No weapon. Nothing. Instant death. Regardless. Oh my god, no. You can't send a message. Thank you for getting me because of the fact that they said they can't do shit. Fuck is that? This area is just hella, you know, freaking Don Machi all over again. What if it's friendly? Well, but no, it could be the thing.
Easy kill. Why waste paper? Who the fuck would have a meeting in a dungeon? That's what the weirdest but Well, yeah! What if this is a trap, though? Lose, but everything they gain, so yeah, just go. It does also make me wonder when the freak is Mito coming back? Because, like, I mean, <laughs> girl, where you at? the guy The thing is, if you really wanted to see someone die, why don't you just go ahead and kill your leader? Or would that be too easy for them, right? Please don't get caught. Shit. sword, right? 
Damn it. How are you going to get that back, though? I mean, we know it's not the one she normally uses, but still. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, okay. Your inside voices? Okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, she's been here the whole time. What was that for? The fuck is that? <laughs> Did 
to, but I, I did too, even though we know you ain't dead, but still, it's like, mm, in that moment, you're like, yes, complete and total despair of the depression. <laughs> He's an idiot. Freaking idiot. I can't win him. Damn, we're like literally still almost halfway point. You know, I ain't even here yet. What? The pretty cure is supposed to interact with the pretty cure. Again, what are we doing? Oh. Hell, that doesn't even surprise me that she was a former beta tester. I mean, still. You never know. And then it's like, oh, okay, you were one too? Mm. You're gonna fight with the banana. With the banana. I'm still just what uh, a damn. Uh, it could be a banana. It could be a platinum. I don't know. Girl is over here. Like yes, I can fight with this.
You know, gossip girl things, you know, the regular. Yeah, because, you know, people have nothing else better to do. I mean, they're here, so what else are you supposed to think they're going to do? Yeah, they really just don't care. I guess the good old 2023, mm, seven months in, and this year is blah. <laughs> I mean, mm, there, there's been some good, yeah, there's been some bad, but... Is there a reason why you don't want to show your face? Oh, 
you're a girl. Is that who I think that is? No, that's not her. Okay. Voice wise, I'm like thinking it was somebody else. No, that does sound like her. Shit, when we're done. At least hear him out, damn. Guild flag. Makes sense. Watch it be no time limit for it. Right? I mean, we want to avoid that.
I mean, I guess so. There really is nothing else to talk about. Is there a reason why you're trying to leave first? Oh my god. <laughs> of course. Quickly. <laughs> Cheap. But <laughs> it is what it is. Okay. We're going to pause right here. I'll see you guys in one second for the second half. All right. Episode. Um, Lord. I'm sorry. Part two. In three, two, one, go. Right. Is there anyone that you're friends with that isn't a part of your guild? Is nine people even enough? Not really in my opinion. Finally, baby, me too. Yes, yes. It took almost a whole hour, a whole freaking hour, but finally. Give me my pretty cute moment, even though these two will never be in a movie together. <laughs> because tell it. <laughs> you, know, you can technically count, like, the one episode of Hagato where it featured everybody, but still. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> 
the freaking fury. Oh my god. Ma'am, what is that going to do? So if, she, if you lose or win or whatever, come on. Seriously, don't hold back. He's so fucking cute. <laughs> Gee, I'm not the necklace. I can't. It's too much. Oh my goodness. What? <laughs> Just felt like a kiss goodbye. Oh my god. They're never gonna see each other again.
And see, now we just went from fucking pretty cure to Don Machi and like a second. <laughs> You would probably do the same. You technically did the same in the first movie, kind of. Which means you, and I mean, you should go be there. That is your girlfriend. You want to support her. you know, add girl, girlfriend, even though they're not together. In, in a weird reality, they could have ended up together. <laughs> I mean, she says that now. But then I see you know you're gonna fall for him just as much as the rest of us. We all freaking did it. The fact that everything is going oh so smooth right now, something, something bad's coming. I know it. You know it. We all know it. It's coming. Somebody might die. by herself girl because you know if this is a horror movie she died first right
What the fuck? Mm -mm. I wouldn't step on that. Never mind. Never mind. She just went. So Right? I, I mean, that's a dumb question to ask. Honestly, you would just think the whole body is just gonna appear. I mean, damn, like, you're doing the arms, the legs, next, you know, a head is gonna come out. Oh, God, no! Wow. Screwed. Big ol' screwed. One thing I'm also going to say is, yes, they're making good, like, moves and attacks on the arms, legs, whatever. But what about the fucking head? How were you supposed to attack that thing when that thing is on the freaking ceiling? Come on now. Oh, wait, no. Okay, no, never mind. Never mind. I thought that something was about to happen, but no. The one time that you kind of wish you had a mage in the group. The one time. Is it getting closer? Is anybody- everybody gonna make it down? Um... 
Where'd it go? Is it gonna come? Oh my god! If y'all don't hurry, she's gonna die, and I don't really want to see that. We know it's not gonna happen, but still. Girlfriend. Girlfriend. The wife to the rescue! The creature from the rescue! <laughs> He's so fucking cute, I can't.
Now, why do I feel like because it has that much left, the last part's going to be the hardest to find? Now the whole thing just wants to come down. The good thing about it is it is slow, so... I wanted Mido to get the final hit. That's okay. Oh. Well, second to last hit, but that's okay. <laughs> Nobody died. No one died. Oh my god. Yay! Oh god, I mean for several moments. Hey, somebody is definitely dying. Like, oh, this show. We know this show, but like, oh, thank god. Hooray! Oh my god. Okay, so where's the guild flag? <laughs> oh 
my hair you fell well. Oh my god. I can't with you two. Goodbye. <laughs> Uh -huh. That's probably going to be like the literally, we're not even going to probably see her for the rest of this film. Damn. Damn. You know, you ain't gotta be an ass. Like, oof. Yeah. About to say. Yeah, I mean, don't... Mm -hmm. I really don't trust that one.
No, baby, you crying. Oh. <laughs> no. It's not the first that she'll be shedding tears for you, so. Aww. Oh, they could just end the movie right there. Bang. Done. Don't need anything else. Right? Why are you acting sus?
hella behind them. Oh, okay, no, that was the door. Oh, but he'll make it last. Now see for a moment, is he who I think he is? Voice wise, no, but the way the character's acting, kind of, maybe, I don't know, but it doesn't seem like him. It is him! But because that fucker said some shit. Come on now. Somebody was talking to someone and of course they found out. Oh, well, we know that. Oh my fucking god, we got five minutes left? What is this?
Was that supposed to be Argo? Because, I mean, because of the freaking fireworks and everything, that could have been her. It seemed like it was her. I don't know. This was good. It was. Both movies. Like, damn. But really, that's it. I'm not mad at it. It was good. Fucking brilliant. 10 out of 10. 20 out of 20. 1,000 out of 1,000. I mean, but it, it's still, the way they leave it, it, it still leaves you wanting more and such. But dang, you think there would be at least like a third movie or something, but... I get it. <laughs> they just like, yeah, go ahead and rewatch the series all over again. <laughs> you know you want it to. <laughs> go ahead and waste so many hours you have just rewatching this show again. And I mean, I get that because I have done that with this show where if I have questions on something, I remember one time, like, I, I think the first time... When I finished both season one and season two, so no, but yeah, yeah, we can say season one, and season two. I rewatched it and saw things that I didn't notice the first time, and I was like, yeah, mm -hmm. that's why you always rewatch. It, but it was good, seriously. I mean, I love the fact that yes, they end it with a happy ending, despite knowing all the shit that's about to come and stuff. When you've seen the original series, I do also like. The fact that Asuna got a little, like, a lot of more development in this. Because seeing her and comparing her from this to the original series, especially with, like, the first half of season one, you're like, yeah, I like her. One day we'll get more about her, and who knows, boom, there you go, more about her. I just, once again, I never would have thought that the Asuna we all have known when she officially came into the show went through a, a hella depressing moment just like mo mostly anybody would have if they were stuck in this situation and having a friend ditch you fending for yourself and then you know your savior comes in you team up with him and then everything else comes and then eventually you do meet your friend again and then yeah you see each other and you know yes one of you is happy well no both of you are happy to see each other again but then at the same time you're like as I said in the previous video if it was if it was any other person in a situation like that you know the opposite person be like yeah I really don't want to have anything to do with you you left me there to rot and die like screw you but with Asuna, she's such a forgiving person that if someone screws her over, she's just like, it's okay. I forgive you regardless and such. And she's like, yeah, let's just move on. Like, <laughs> so I, I also love the dynamic between her and Vito. I mean, yeah, if, if you would have told me that the two pretty carriers of two different freaking series, of two different seasons, of two different years would have interacted together. I would have listened to you like you were nuts. I mean, see, no, because see, let, let's talk about the big freaking issue of this. Once again, literally everyone in his freaking harem, all the freaking girls are all pretty cures. All of them. The only one, or, yeah, the only one is Lisbeth. That's it. The only one. And you're just like, ma'am, read the room. Read the room. I, I love how they ended on that. That's cute. Oh my god. <laughs> but still, read the room. Read the room. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? It's like the freaking Simpo Gear Girls. You know, when it's like, yes, oh my god, look, you know, person A and person B and person C, they're all pretty care. So, you know, let's come for this. Because I, I never would have been like, damn, like, you know what? I just. One day, if you would have told me that he has a harem, a pretty curious, I just would have looked at you like you were nuts, being like, what the F are you talking about? And then you just go look up the sinews, and then you're like, what? <laughs> just...
<laughs> it, it's so weird because it no, it was even weirder like going back to fucking Alitization and just in the moment of Asana and Alice. And at that time, freaking Alice is saying you. She was not in Pretty Cure yet. And such. And then going back and rewatching that, I'm like, you know what, man? Once again, Pretty Cures are fighting. And then going on Twitter, like, yeah, they're gonna be out there. <laughs> and, and it's just also thinking this is the only time where once again they're only really going to interact because with the situation of Tele, um, especially with what has been announced, of course, we're only taking, of course, certain cures who don't have a quote unquote partnership with another cure that they can transform together and then boom. But really, y'all couldn't go really OG OG. Y'all could not do all of these ones right here that I could list, there's a lot. You can go cure black, cure white, but it's okay. I'm not mad at that. But seriously, this was really good. I mean, I also love the fact that, and with Mito and Asuna's relationship, like, basically, it, it is a, it's a Yuri. You, you look at it straight up. It's a freaking Yuri. And, and you do ship them. The fact, even though they're not really platonically in a relationship together, she technically, they were in something. They did care about each other so freaking much and stuff and always wanted to protect each other. So, I mean, in a way, you can say Asuna fell in love with someone else before she met Kiyuto and such. And then in some weird way, let's say in an alternate universe and such, they could have been canon. And it would, like, see, shit, I would have loved to have been a fly on the wall for that. But yes, I still love my awesome and Kita, because, you know, that that's Libra love. So, yes, I love that, regardless. But yeah, I mean, seriously, this was very different um, from the usual S of SIO. And it, it wasn't really that bad. I loved how it was done and such. It does make me get well, funnily answers that I've had one of questions on answers that I've wondered for like a hot minute, especially like from going from the beginning all the way to Alitization and then getting the con the firm of this series and such into movies and like how the freak it's gonna go. But now the biggest thing is I'm kind of wondering where let's kind of look at the future of this series because from what I have heard, this series is very close to being done and so. I wish I could go get my phone, but it's over there. How many minutes I got left? I still got a lot. Okay. So from what I heard, the next arc that we're going into is the final arc of this series overall. Um, how I think a couple of days ago, I was on Amazon just like looking up book covers and such. And I, I, I was very confused on one. Of course, it's Asuna, Kirito, and Alice together. And... I have a lot of questions about what the frick is going on, but of course, like, I will probably never get them answered and such. You know, yeah, what what book we on English-wise for translations? Are the translations all the way done? Has somebody finished the series? You know, you can give me answers, something. But hey, Gun Girl Online Season 2 is coming! Yeah! <laughs> I mean, honestly, let's talk about that. I never would have thought that that would have gotten a season two. So, hey, I I'm glad that that is getting a second season because it is super underrated compared to SAO. I mean, yes, like, SAO was hella big and such. But I feel like, in my opinion, when Gun Girl Online came out, the hype and everything for it was pretty lackluster like a lot of people were excited for it but I think the up and coming weeks that it aired it kind of slowly died down kind of how I feel like with um <laughs> Promise Everland in a nutshell uh Rising of the Shield Hero even though I am still excited for that and such and so even though yeah I'm super excited that season two is coming it does make me wonder is it going to be um continuing from the series aka the books or is it going to be like something anime only there's a lot of things that they could go but yeah like i said this was really good i would love possibly in the future if they really wanted to continue something to focus more on asana yeah go ahead and do it i mean she best girl shit the fact that you know mito is not coming back anymore it, it is sad truly that is a sad day for you know me because uh, <laughs> I have to wait how long to hear her as Hestia again? Oh, God. 
That's sad. Oh, God. See, why couldn't you be in the new Pretty Care movie, ma'am? I mean, I'm glad that they chose my best girl to represent Kitty Kitty Pretty Girl mode, but it would have been nice if they just would have put CL in the damn movie. That's perfect. I mean, mm, mwah, but it's okay. Next time. Next time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, this was good. Very, very enjoyable. Definitely was sit and rewatch it again. But other than that, guys, that is my action view towards the second movie of SAO Progressive. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next time. But until then, I will see you guys later. Bye!